Hi, it's Michael Lafito, author of the book Luxury Listing Specialist and founder of the Lux designation known as Luxury Listing Specialist. In this video, we're going to talk about fresh eyes analysis. But before we do that, again, if you're getting value from these videos or previous videos or maybe our podcast or our book, please leave us a like, leave us a review, subscribe, share it. Again, I'm asking of you what you would hopefully ask of your client if you do a great job servicing them. In this video, we're going to be talking about a fresh eyes analysis. And when I talk about a fresh eyes analysis, I'm talking about your listings. When you look at your own listings, you probably don't see mistakes. You don't see opportunities. It's no different than when I went to Northern Michigan and I had to take a, an essay exam when I, to graduate. I had to write an essay, a five paragraph essay. Guess what? I failed the first time. I had to hire a tutor because guess what? I would look at my paper that I wrote and I, I had misspelled words or bad grammatical errors, but to me, I didn't see it because I write that way. You, the way you present the properties you represent, you might not see errors. It's hard for you to poke holes through your own properties. You should have a colleague, someone that you like, you trust, that's experienced, that you can have them look at your properties before you go live. And then if you're not getting showings, you're not getting uh, activity or offers, maybe have somebody else or several people look at your listings to give a fresh eyes analysis. Again, I speak on national stages and many of my topics, I let the host know, hey, please have any of the guests, any of the people in attendance to submit any stale luxury listings they have, listings that aren't getting showings, the seller's on them about doing something different. There's no offers. And so they'll submit to me an email with links to photos, single property website, video, videos, and probably 90% of the time I'm able to poke holes through things because I, I call it elephants in the room or remember from the hotels.com, Captain Obvious. A lot of times there's some Captain Obvious glaring things that, I, that jump out to me, mistakes, things that can be positioned in the home, just tweaked little modifications. You know, small hinges open big doors. Sometimes just small tweaks to your listing can open up a lot of opportunities because buyers can't visualize. Again, my contact information is below. If this video was helpful to you, please leave us a review, leave us a comment. And if you have any other questions, please contact us. Keep raising the bar in real estate and prove others wrong. Take care.